She even had a smile for me. Rare as hen's teeth, that, a smile for me. Try not to worry, Horn. Easy for you to say. Your job's not on the line. But it won't come to that. What do you know about it? Yeah, well, she won't get away with it, the lying little bitch. I'll see to that. You've taken my statement, miss. I really don't have anything else to add. Not much of a statement, though, is it? You were in the room, but you didn't actually see Shaz get hit? No. So, the truth is, you don't really know what happened? Well, it's obvious what happened. Two people were involved in an altercation, and one of them was injured. Don't be clever, Barbara. Do you believe Mr Pierce actually punched Shaz? Well, he's certainly capable of it. And he's like, pow! You should have seen his eyes. Bastard. And to think they was defending, defending him. him. Girl, you was right about him all along, Babs. Blokes, huh? Shaz Wiley. You seen this, miss? She did that injury to herself. <laughs> I thought I heard everything, man. Now the screws are saying we're going around assaulting ourselves. You. Stop this nonsense. Now. And you. I thought I could trust you to tell the truth. The facts speak for themselves. We know it hurts, miss. He's your fella. You love him. Yeah. So we're thinking straight for you. Dump him. Just shut up. You are disgusting. Every one of you. Oh, for God's sake, woman, will you just wake up? Good. Shall Barry be well pleased? Some uh, cell changes on G Wing. Can you see to them after the meeting? Purvis and Mackenzie on enhanced. Problem? Are you kidding? Since when have they earned that? Well, we've got to punish Atkins for doing a runner. And I need bodies on the threes. Anyway, it's Sylvia's recommendation. Well, I'm sorry. Sylvia's had one too many cream cakes. Look, Jim, I'm not being difficult. I'd be unprofessional if I didn't give you my honest opinion. No. What's unprofessional is letting your antagonism towards me cloud your judgment. Excuse me? That's what's happening here, isn't it? Let's be honest for once. I can't agree to put Purvis or Mackenzie on enhanced. Fine. Get someone else to do it. Miss Barker, just leave me alone. I didn't mean to snap like I did. I'm sorry. You call yourself a Christian? Bearing false witness? Because that's what you've done, haven't you? I haven't said anything about Mr Pierce that I don't honestly believe to be the truth. <laughs> Maybe Mrs Hollenby's right. Prisoners really are a different breed. We're only trying to help you because... because we think he hits you. And you'll be making a terrible mistake if you marry him. Yeah. yeah well, it just goes to show, doesn't it? I'm sorry, but not everyone can be mad, bad or sad like you lot. Me and Mr Pierce are just normal, ordinary people who love each other. Faults and all. Having made a thorough inquiry, no corroborating evidence has been found to back up Shaz Wiley's accusations. You're officially in the clear, Barry. I should think so, too. Thank you. Thanks for all your support. All for one and one for all. Or those hyenas will tear us to shreds. Yeah, well, it still doesn't make any sense to me. 
I mean, I know Barbara Hunt's lying. Why? I don't know. I mean, it's so unlike her. Well, I hope they know I can sue them for slander after what they accuse me of. Well, you've taken a load off our minds, Karen. We've been nervous wrecks all week, haven't we, Barry? Well, hardly. I'm innocent, and you have be proved. Of course. Fact is, mate, Wiley's clearly got it in for you. So watch your back, all right? Yeah, I will. Wiley's the one who should watch it. Oh, one last thing, so. Could you see to it that Maxie Purvis... Get over word, Jim. OK, folks, that's all. Have you lost the plot? Maxie Purvis on Enhanced. Please explain. Well, I realise Purvis is a borderline candidate. Borderline? From what I've seen, she's verging on sociopathic. I'm oh, sorry, Jim. I'm going to have to overrule you on this one. You conniving little bitch. I didn't go running to the number one. It just obviously shared my opinion. Why do you give a shit where Purvis is, hmm? Why do you? Karen, you ready? Sure. What's the matter, Fenner? You don't look happy. A little shagbag Purvis giving you trouble, is she? You never learn. You better start minding your manners, Atkins. Or what? You'll shag some murdering little tart and fix me up for what she's done. Ah, oh, you've already done that. Haven't you? What a week. Yeah. Still, at least you've got the support of everyone at work. I don't think Shaz Wiley will try a stunt like that again. What are we talking about that sad little con for, anyway? It's just supposed to be a celebration. The future. You and me. Mm. And you, Mum. Tell you what, when I sell my house, we'll get something a better size. Big enough for your mum as well. What, and have her come and live with us? Yeah. You'd be prepared to do that? Do what? She's a sweet old lady. You appreciate them when you've lost them, don't you? Come on, drink up. Oh, what's with the waterworks? Sorry. No, Di, what is it? It's just... Oh, you are so wonderful, Barry. Sometimes you really are. Offering to have Mum come and live with us. Most blokes would run a mile. I'm not most blokes, am I? No, you're not. Still, I think it'd be better if we leave her where she is for the time being. Well, it's up to you. Oh! I finally sorted out my wedding outfit. What, you're not wearing your uniform? No. <laughs> I'm pulling your leg, die. For Christ's sake, have a drink. I don't know, sometimes it's like pulling teeth trying to get a laugh out of you. Mm. I knew bloody bets would clear him. Yeah, well, that screws on her, innit? Always look after their own. Just hate to think how Miss Barker end up. Silly cow. Well, a lot of women are very desperate for love, Shaz. You end a good Roger in. in. <laughs> Miss Barker's as desperate as they can get. Yeah, and that man knows it. At least he's a lover. Yeah, but look what he done to Shaz, Jew. You think Miss Barker ain't gonna get the same and worse? Why are men bastards? Hello, Barbara. 
Time to chat, have we? I'm 